Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Stripe with Pioneer in 2023. Combining the power of Stripe payments processing with Pioneer Global Payment Solutions can help streamline your online business financial operations. So in this tutorial, we'll walk you through the process of connecting your Stripe account with Pioneer, allowing you to efficiently manage your funds. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into it and let's get started before we start with this video make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience first we'll have to go and sign up for a stripe account if you don't have a stripe account head up to the stripe website and sign up for an account to do so go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with here in my case i'm actually going to use the brave browser and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have once you do so, go to this URL section and simply type stripe.com and hit the enter button. Now you'll be taken to the home screen or main screen of Stripe accounts. As we said, if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and sign up for an account. But before, make sure to scroll down, read more information about Stripe as an example, and uh, familiarize yourself with the website to be sure that you want to uh, accept like Stripe as a payment gateway. And if you already have an account, you can simply find the top, at the top right corner an option to sign in into your account with, instead of this dashboard. I find here dashboard because I'm already signing into my account. And for you, if you don't have an account, you can simply click on start now. And then you'll have to provide the necessary details and complete the, the registration process. Sorry. So for me, I'm just going to access into my dashboard. Before that, of course, one, make sure to access your Stripe dashboard once you created your account or just log in into your account and enable the payouts. And so make sure to enable the payouts external account and even accept this payment. Click on accept payment and just follow the steps provided here. Finish them as you can see. So verify your business, add your bank, secure your account, add extras and review everything and finish and you will be able to accept payments. Make sure to even to enable a test op uh, mode as example at the top right corner so you can test your payments gets away once you add it to your Pioneer account. Now, make sure to go as an example and if you haven't already signed up for a Pioneer account, you make sure to go and do so. I've already made a video on how to uh, sign up for a Pioneer account if you need some guidance. So for me, I'm just going to open a new tab here and simply I'm going to type Pioneer.com and as you can see from here, if you don't have an account, click on register at the middle. And if you have an account, you'll simply have to click on sign in at the top right corner. For me, I'm just going to click on sign in here and I'll just to enter my, I have to enter my details and click on sign in. And of course, if you're new to Pioneer, you can click on sign up instead. So here we have our accounts. So now we'll be able to add like a Pioneer account and Stripe. So here, of course, make sure to go and access your settings and set up like bank account and Pioneer or sorry, add Pioneer account and Stripe. You'll find that in payouts, you can click on add a new bank account and enter your Pioneer account details, including like the account number and routing number. Of course, this step, you will have to do it while you are activating your payment. So as an example here, you'll have to verify your business first. And this step will be on add in your bank. Once you reach add in your bank, you will have to add your Pioneer account stri uh, in Stripe and you will be good kind of to go. Then Stripe will make a small deposit into your Pioneer account to verify, to verify it, of course. You can go to your Pioneer and check, uh, of course, to your Pioneer account for this deposit and check Check if anything comes in there and enter your Pioneer account details, including like the, or sorry. And once you see it, you can go back to your Stripe dashboard to confirm the verification. So from here, of course, you'll be able even to configure the payout settings. So in the Stripe dashboard, you can configure the, your payout settings. You can set like the frequency of payouts and choose whether to receive funds automatically uh, if you want to, or even manually. You can, of course, even like review or before even finalizing the setup, you can review all the information you've entered to ensure like accuracy. Once you're certain everything is correct, confirm this integration. And now your Stripe account is connected to your Pioneer account and your payouts from Stripe will be automatically sent to your Pioneer account according to the payout schedule you conf you've confi configured. And of course, you'll be able to do all of that example on the payments here. As an example, so if you already like connected your Pioneer, you'll find this here. You'll be able to do automatical payment or even manual one. On the settings, of course, you'll be able even to 
as you can see from here, uh, add some checkouts, a payment list or payment links, sorry, payments methods, automatic uh, currency conversion if like the currency on your binder is different from uh, Stripe and etc. So here we have even the billing plans, subscri subscription, emails, invoice templates, code templates customer portal and all of other stuff that you can choose of course you have payments uh billing connects data pipeline uh, claimates radar and here for the business settings so depending on whatever you want of course you'll be able to do all of that as you can see so you can go and check everything that you want depending on whatever you want so once you're done of course make sure to enable this test mode as we said before to uh, make a test deposit as we said before so make your test deposits and of course go here to Pioneer and check if you receive any deposit. Of course, the test deposits will be zero dollars or zero of your currency. And just to check if your uh, credentials that you entered on Stripe of Pioneer is correct or not. If it's correct, you'll receive your deposits here on Pioneer and you will be kind of good to go. So you'll be able to even customize this and you'll be able even to add it into like uh, one of your websites if you have some like in WooCommerce and uh, Wix website and whatever website you may have so as an example you can go uh, to whatever websites you have even WooCommerce like Webflow or something like that and from there you'll be able to even go and add the plugin of Stripe or even Pioneer so once both integrated with each other with each other one of them will work for both so go and look for any of them add it to your website and of course connect to your Stripe or Pioneer account and people will be able to buy as an example your products with Pioneer or even Stripe for you if it's if it's on integrated for you that means it's already cool you don't have to do kind of anything so and you will be after that good to go if you reach of course this point of this video uh, congratulations you've successfully connected your stripe account with pioneer making it easier to manage your online business finances transaction of course so in this integration or this integration will allow you to receive payouts from stripe directly into your pioneer account which can be incredibly convenient especially for international transactions so with this seamless connection, you can phone focus on growing your business while enjoying efficient payments processing. So if you found this video or this guide helpful, please consider giving it a thumbs up and stay tuned for more tutorials or subscribe for our channels for more or for our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one. So happy business management with Stripe and Pioneer. And of course, if you have any issues, you can always go and leave them down below in the comment section. I'll try to come back to you as soon as possible or go and contact the Stripe or even Pioneer if you want to. Is the support of them. So that's going to be it for me. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you in the next video.